Yeah, man, no problem. So I don't want to miss my cab. No, 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 we're waiting for a minute. Oh, really? Oh, right, okay, cool. 73,000 pounds, not 80. It's not 80 pounds. We're all top, you know, actually leave it from one of you. Yeah, I thought Billy Joe Saunders did really well. He was boxing and moving, he was in the fight. You know, you're in front of Canelo Alvarez, he's throwing them big thumping body shots. Just crushing body and head as well. And he was he was half soaking it up, half blocking it, Billy, and then he got it over a couple over the top of the side and you know he was brave, he stayed in there and he was you know, he was confident and putting shots together and I was impressed. He was winning rounds. You know, I think he was behind. He was definitely behind on the official cards. But Chris Mannix, who works for the zone, he had Billy Joe Saunders ahead. So, you know, there was like in what they were seeing. Where does Billy Joe go from here? What's next? It's, it's difficult. Chris it's difficult now. Yeah, potentially that'd be a big fight, but he needs to he needs to get back and get his eyes sore and then see how he feels because that was a that was a heavy Maybe now it's work for him. I think now, he'll come again. How can I want to become undisputed? You think he'll get a crack at Kelly Plant or has the belt? Yeah, potentially. I mean, that's that's a great fight. So hopefully one that will happen. How would you assess Kelly Plant as a fight? I think it's good. I mean, it's, it's, it's class. What is he, the IBF champ? IBF champ. So this is a unification fight if it's undisputed, if it happens. Um, I like him. I think he's got class, good boxing skills, good movement. So he can certainly give Canelo some problems. But Canelo's a crushing dominant force at the minute, a 168. I just wish I was fighting a 168 now, because I reckon I'd, um, I'd give him some smoke. How, how, how would that fight play out between you and Canelo? What do you know your fight? I'd try and box and move, but I'd meet him as he comes. I'd stand and have a fight with him, and that could be to my demise, because he's a powerful man. Now, I know but, before that, we spoke about undisputed. UK being on the speed of fight, so we announce hopefully soon Joshua against Fury. How do you, you know, who do you give the edge on that? I think I give Fury edge just. You know, the closer the fight comes, the longer it takes to get made. It starts to tip the scales towards Anthony Joshua. Rob McCracken knows his stuff, and I know what he'll be working on going into that fight. Um, but I'll make Tyson Fury the slight favourite. Now, I know you were in Saudi Arabia for the last fight, uh, Joshua and Do you think that's a perfect location to do it at? Uh, no, of course it's not a perfect location. It's in Saudi Arabia. We're in Britain, yeah? Stay in Britain. Get Wembley Stadium opened up. Get it filled. Two British fighters fighting for the undisputed heavyweight title. Why are we going somewhere else? Would that uh, fight if we're in For the money, that obviously. Would that be 80,000 uh, Probably be 90, mate. Probably be 90. 79, When he fought... Um, 79. When he fought... <laughs> we'll count at 79. Yeah, when he fought Klitschko, it was 90,000. Big numbers. Yes. Nearly got the 8 tier tonight, didn't they? Nearly, oh, ma nearly matched the code. Yeah. Yeah. So you're good, you're good. Yeah, yeah I'm still good here. You're still good. <laughs>